Back now with several months of mystery for police in Portsmouth. It stems from a deadly shooting in August. All they know is that Demetrius White was dropped off at Maryview Hospital where it happened and how is are still being questions to the to this day. Big questions. Our Jason Marks is live in Portsmouth Police Headquarters with more on the detective's ordeal after this shooting. Jason. Tom, the lead detective in this case says he leaves here and goes home and there are nights where he can't sleep. He's so worried about the, solving this murder. He says he's looking for that one piece of information that so far has not come to light. Whenever Portsmouth Police Detective Larry Gibbs opens a case, he has one goal in mind. Eventually, I want to bring the person responsible to justice. In 2015, he worked five murders, solved all but one. Tough one I've had, yes. Every page in the investigation completes a story. But in this case, a murder victim 22-year-old Demetrius White, some of the pages are missing. We need all the help we can get. This story begins here on this busy Portsmouth Road. Mid-afternoon, August 2nd, 2015. Police say White was standing along this area of Victory Boulevard. And even with two gunshot wounds, he was still able to flag down a car for help. He was driven here to Maryview Medical Center where he died. Because I, you know, I take it personally. I want to get solved. The problem for police, the crime scene could be anywhere. You know, we, we normally have, um, some kind of physical evidence. It was blood, shell casings, um, something. Police don't even know if the crime happened in Portsmouth. Detective Gibbs gave ten on your side these photos of the scene outside Maryview. White came in with one wound to his chest, another to his leg. They're hoping this car could help trigger someone's memory. Somebody knows something out there. Gibbs says the driver is no longer cooperating with police, and he believes he knows more than he's telling. Try telling that to White's family. Once we find out why it happened and, like I said, who, it almost like just like closed the case. All police say they need is that one small lead. It would be great if I could do that, you know, because that's what the ultimate goal is. And police are looking for that one tip. No matter how big or small, they say that could help crack this case wide open if you have any information give the crime line a call. We're live in tonight in Portsmouth. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.